What's up, Mr. Gang? In this Vlogmas day, what? It's time! <laughs> so today, y'all, we're doing a late night story time, and I'm with... Cam! It's your girl, Cam, with two. It's not, not one. one. Girl's actually lavish, Cam. You know. You know, you Call know. Me Cam, not lavish. <laughs> so y'all, basically, this literally happened yesterday. Whoa. This morning, for this real. This morning, for real. This happened at four o'clock in, in the, the morning. morning. Like this girl hit my car while my baby was in the car, and I was trying to fire her. And she's wow, delusional. Why her baby is in the car. I'm not delusional, y'all. Let delusional. me know in the comments delusional. if I'm delusional after y'all hear this story time. Okay, okay, okay. Before I get into this video, I want to let everyone know if you are in the Chicago area, I am coming out to Chicago for an event. I'm going to put it up on the screen so y'all can see. All my supporters, come out, show love. I'm doing a meet and greet. Y'all will be able to meet me, take pictures, and Cam will be there also as well. So it's and like many a, more. Many more. Many more. Many more. Many, 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 many more. So if y'all out in Chicago, go ahead and Go in my description, press the link so y'all can go get y'all tickets. Or you can go onto my Instagram. The link will be in my description on Sunday. Y'all tell y'all friends, tell y'all cousins, tell y'all sisters, tell everybody because on Sunday, tickets are going to be on sale and I'm coming to Chicago. We're coming to Chicago and, and many, many, many more. more and many, many more. But y'all, without further ado, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. Wait, Misty. What? You didn't tell them how to get the money before the holidays. Oh, over. right. Just this is so perfect because Christmas coming up. Thank you for reminding me because I've been trying to tell everybody this because Christmas coming up, and I know y'all probably want to get y'all's parents something. Or maybe y'all want to get y'all something for yourself. Or maybe y'all just need a little extra cash. Yeah. Because I know yeah. what I do. Yeah. Me personally, I did the link like four five times already so i'm saying you can do that link as many times as you want you can get 750 on top of 750 on top of 750 as many times as you want so y'all if y'all looking forward into earning up to 750 dollars on cash app all you have to do is go in the link in my description press the link in my description answer three simple questions put your email in for confirmation and as soon as they confirm you when i say as soon as they confirm you you need to send them your cash tag <laughs> go press the link right now because the link it's gonna be over with. Like these spots are taking fast. They so running it up. They running it up. So running run it up, up as many times as you can before it runs out. Because I did mine, so I'm good. So I'm good to tell people. Cause as I, I'm not as little. Go do it. Yeah, okay. go do it. That that's a little selfish of me to kind of like do it first. But you know, I need my money first because you know it's the first come first serve, and I just have to be like one of the first people. But y'all, go in my description right now if y'all want to earn up to seven hundred and fifty dollars to cash up. And if y'all need any help, any help. Text my DMs. I'm checking my DMs. I didn't text people, help them make up to seven hundred and fifty dollars back to back to back to back to back to back to back. So if y'all need help and y'all come through to, with a little bit of technical difficulty, a little bit of technical difficulty, just text me on Instagram. I'll help y'all. But y'all, without further ado, let's, let's get, get into this video. I think well, let's get into this video. It's not even funny anymore. Okay. Like, it was funny at first, but now this time, get it right. Come on, let's you, go. You're the one who going the wrong way. Missy, let's go. Okay, let's get into this video. It, it was, was a me. nice, cold night. <laughs> nice. Leaving our she don't, night. don't ask why we was out at 4 in the morning, because we were leaving our photo shoot. Yeah, yeah, we were leaving our photo shoot at 4 in the morning. We took all day to get there. So I got the time. time. She got the time. She got the time. She got the time. Somewhere. Somewhere. Keep going. Okay, okay, okay. She got the time somewhere. Anyway, she was like 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. We were just leaving our photo shoot. It was me, Duda, and Kim. We took Christmas pictures, by the way. And if y'all interested in the same house, go on my Instagram. And make sure y'all go book with 36 Vision if you are in the metro Detroit area. Period. Period. I'm going to show y'all whenever the pictures come be ready. Anyways, y'all. Let me tell y'all. So we're leaving our photo shoot, and you know, y'all know how it's a regular street, right? It's like a crisscross street. And I'm in the back seat with Duda because yeah. I have to make sure he's okay, you know? She's yeah. driving in case he cries. I'm on standby to feed him. Yes, whatever. she was on standby with Duda. So, okay, so. I'm like this. <laughs> she, yeah, she texting, and I'm just driving, you know, chilling like any other day. So, okay, I'm going down this way. And it's a girl, and she coming on this way. It's a green light for me, by the way. It's a red light for her. So I'm going. I'm thinking she going to stop because it's a red light. This girl keep going. This girl hits my car, and my baby is in the car, y'all. 
And y'all, all I felt was Misty go. I'm trying to swerve. I felt the car sure. jump a little bit after she swerved. So I'm thinking we hit an island. But I don't no think it was, it's not no islands on, on, on the street oh. we was on. So she jumped. I instantly just started going off of Misty. Because Misty always doing something crazy. I like, do always do something crazy. Night. But this time I wasn't. I swear I was driving the speed limit. Because my baby in the car. I was driving the speed limit. Driving cool. Ready to just go home. Get in the bed. Y'all. This the, girl hit my car. And the only reason I did. I calmed down on Misty. Is because she started. I heard her. Like she was kind of like on the car butt. And she like. Baby. No. You just hit. Right. No. She didn't even say she the that um they hit the car. She was like. Are you crazy? My baby in the car. No. You need to pull over. No. For real like i'm over here and at this point i'm talking to myself because the girl ain't even stopped like she so was just she started she was, driving slower though yes i'm beeping i'm thinking she's gonna stop she ain't never stop i'm beeping girl ain't never stop so i started chasing her because she's like you think you're just gonna hit my car with my baby in the car and get away with it no i do not play about my son any if it was just me okay fine but my baby's in the car you're too far too far so i'm chasing after this girl cam in the back seat like Trying to make sure Duda's straight, y'all. Because I me... almost didn't collapse on Duda. Why are everybody moving in the back? Like, my baby could have got hurt in any type of way, y'all. That's what made me so freaking mad. It, like, made a switch just. It I just didn't even... got fast. This Misty, Misty normally be like, okay, Kim. Like, she normally calmed down. This, I could not calm this Misty down, y'all. <laughs> I'm sorry. Down. Beast mode just came out of me, y'all. So, long story short, we get to a red light. Like, they stop, and I pulled over to the side of her room. I'm wondering, I'm like, excuse me, ma'am. You just hit my car. Hello. And then she was like, where did I hit your car? I didn't hit your car. I'm like, you did hit my car. Like, She's like, is about? it a scratch on it? And Missy's like, I don't know. I didn't get out. She was like, well, can you look or something? I don't see a scratch. And Missy's like, if I get out, no, I'm not getting out. Because if I get out, I'm going to beat your ass. I'm going to beat your ass. If I get out of this car, I'm going to beat your ass. Because just like... You just in my car, my baby in the car. You could have died or something. That's scary. And old girl, she she knew she was wrong, so she right. was trying to. She was kind of like on some like like not scary jump, but like on some on trying some, to be cool type yeah. jump. But when trying Missy to be said cool, that, but talking crazy, but yeah, cool or crazy. When Missy said that, she like who who, and she like she opened the door and Missy got out. I said, Missy, come on, chill, bro. bro yo, yo, because yo, yo, I wanted to fight right, right then and there. Like I wanted to fight right then and there. So I started butting my seat up and get out the car. And this girl, she like, she like mm -mm, follow me. She like follow, follow me, me, follow me. So I said, bet. So then she started driving real fast. So and I'm, I'm like, Misty, I'm like, like Misty, stop, bro. She, I mean, what if we something gonna happen? Where are we? I'm just y'all. I'm like, the mom at this Cam, point. Cam, she's the mom at the this point, and I'm the kid. So Cam, study talking. I'm not even gonna lie. I ain't hear nothing she said. She's out or something. I it's heard another for her. It took for the girl to be driving for a long time. Yeah. And Misty kind of got like on the side of her as we were like kind of following them. Yeah. She got on the side of her and she's like, You've been driving for too long. You didn't stop. Yeah, I'm like, So stop she starts, she like, uh uh, uh uh. So Misty like, Okay, we're going yeah. for a far time. She calls her uncle. Um, auntie. Yeah, I call my auntie because we driving for too long. I'm thinking we finna park right here and there. And like fight at a different right spot because we were there. in the middle of a street. I don't care if it was in the middle of the street. I wanted to fight right then and there. I don't know. I know it was just something in my system that just wanted to fight something right then and there. For hitting my car yes, when my yes, baby yes, was in it. <laughs> so then I put up to the side of her again because we going. And at this point, the girl like this. Oh, Mind y'all at the red light, the girl like, oh yeah, oh I know her, her Instagram, something like, yeah, she like, yeah, it known that's that bitch busy. from Instagram, da 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 da, yeah, I know her, yeah, I know her, of course. And Misty kept saying, somebody on the passenger seat that we know, she couldn't think of the name, and I'm yeah. like, who, like, who? I just knew her face, so I had to, I had to think like, one yeah. of our friends used to like mess with the girl, but then, so the second time we got on, the, she got on the side of her, the girl like this. Yeah, ah, ah, she recorded us talking about with the flash. Like, ah, she just recorded me. Like, girl, you're so big, girl. And Missy like, post it, post it. I don't care. You hit my car. Wait, right. I'm like, post it, post. It. I don't care what's your point of what, 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 what's your point. Like, post it. Like, she's a fan. She like, I know you. You from Instagram? Then you want to get to record it? Okay, fan. Do you want an autograph? I'm like, you giving fan. You giving. You want to let it come out? Right. You, you want to let it come out? Hey, for a promo. Like, yeah. Um. I don't want to be part of your head. It was, mm, mm. So Anyways, we keep going. We keep going. I call my auntie. You know, at that point, I call my auntie because at this point, I'm thinking like, I don't know where she's gonna take us, but I know I want to fight. But I don't know who I'm gonna be there. I don't know what was. It was like I, don't, I just had to call my auntie because I knew she was gonna pick up. The phone. And at this point, I'm on the phone with my friends like, y'all come get us. Like I can't control Misty, and I gotta watch the baby. Like come get us. <laughs> so then I, I I look up. And Misty turns down the street, y'all. We done been driving for about eight minutes after following Yes, him. we was driving for a long time. And we not time. driving. We not driving slow. We kind of like doing we're a, we're speeding fast. a little bit. We're we not speeding, speeding. Yeah, but we're driving We're doing fast. at least 
six six over eight over yeah now you're not like a ridiculous yeah but we were just driving a little bit older you know so we turned down the street and i jumped up i said bitch do you see all these cars i said we about to get our i said it's it's and that's crazy because I did not hear nothing Kim was saying. I was just so mad to the point. I my my whole mom blacked her all out. All she knew was was Duda in the car. Yeah, all I knew was Duda in the car. Like <laughs> my mom mm -hmm. Yeah, my like, somebody else to do it. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to be the peacemaker. I'm just like, bro. Yeah, I'm always trying to be a peacemaker. I'm trying to jump, I'm gonna jump. That's she trying to be the peacemaker and that jump was just like, Kim, please stop talking to me right now, Kim. <laughs> so y'all, Kim had to make an appointment phone call, but let me finish the story. So long story short, we pull up, it was a lot of cars where we was at. I didn't know where we was at. I don't know nothing. So I didn't get out the car yet. I waited until my auntie got to where we was at to pull off. I mean to park the car and get out the car. So the girl parked, my auntie, she blocked her in. Then me, I come on the side. So then, she, she wasn't really blocked in. She could have backed up if she wanted, really wanted to be let out. So the girl, then my auntie come out the car. She like, Misty, where, where she hit your car at? Where she hit your car? I'm like, she just literally hit my car right here. Like she's literally hit in my car. And the girl like, is it a scratch on it? Is it a scratch on it? Is it a scratch on it? I didn't know if it was a scratch on it or not. I'm not gonna lie. I didn't know if it was a dent. I didn't know if it was a scratch. I didn't know if it was a paint scratch. I didn't know what it was. All I know is I know she hit my car and my baby was in my car and my baby could at least die, bro. That junk is really scary and everything was just like, if it got something to do with my baby, I'm sorry. It just, it just, it just pushes a trigger on my button. Like it pushes, it, it just, it just pushes a trigger on my button when it's about my baby. So then, she, um, she, so I'm looking. I'm not even gonna lie. I hate to see her scratching the car, but it's still the principle. And I already done followed you all the way here, so I might as well just fight about it. Like I'm not finna, you know, I what I'm finna do? Waste my time? Okay, you didn't put no scratch on my car and leave. No. At this point, this girl calling me out my name. She calling me the B word. She said, that's why your baby daddy did you how you did. She's saying, um, this not Instagram, baby, this real life. Or oh, you from Instagram. Um, you don't know nothing about me, da, da, da. Then she had the nerve to say, I'm 22, you're 18. I'm not finna fight you. She did not want to fight me. This girl did not want to fight me. She did not want to fight me at all. She said stuff like, come on, let's fight, come on, let's fight. But she wasn't really on that, on it. I got out the car. I even got on top of my car, ready. I was ready. Then a girl like, Okay, I feel like when she said she's 22 and I'm 18, that was kind of embarrassing because I'm younger than you and I make more money than you. Money, money, like what? And the only reason I'm saying stuff like that because she's talking bad about me, talking bad about my lifestyle, talking bad about what I do, which means I don't see nothing bad with what I do. There's a lot of people out here that I really influence that should become a YouTuber or influencer or an Instagrammer because you can make a lot of money with this. Like you, you can go far with this. I don't think that's a thing to Donald Shane, baby. I think that's something you should probably be trying to hop on instead a down player what would the car be say no what the girl is say um some something you got but all they do was talking down because they can't get up with me <laughs> i love gorilla she would really be spinning some lyrics but then after that i'm trying to press the girl trying to press the girl to fight she did not want to fight and then when i tell you her brother came out with a gun her brother had a gun when he came out. And as soon as her brother came out, she wanted to start jumping around. Come on, let's fight, da 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 And the only reason she did that is because she knew that her brother had a gun. And my thing is, sir, you could have came down you could have came down, watched us fight, did what you did. But just my point, why would you bring a gun to a girl's fight? That's just so good to me. If your sister finna fight and you see her jumping up and down like she wanna fight, what are you gonna shoot me for? Because the other sister wanna fight. Make it make sense. I mean, I did want to fight at first, but then she didn't want to fight. But when her brother came out, she wanted to act like she wanna fight so bad. So my thing, you see your sister jumping around saying she wanna fight. Why are you showing me? That's just so getting me. Like, let the two girls fight. And like, why are you even there? You're your guy. Like, anyways, long story short. Her brother ended up saying stuff like, y'all don't need to lose y'all lives tonight, so I mind y'all well going home. And it's just like, they started talking about guns and stuff. I'm telling y'all, oh my God. She just started talking real bad about me. Her brother talking about some shooting up people and stuff like that. And it's just really weird to me that I had my baby in the car the whole time. Like, soon as he started talking about guns, I started, like, calming down a little bit. Because it's just like, y'all talking about guns. I got my baby in the car. I said if it was a little fist fight. But y'all talk about guns now? That's too much. If you want to fight about it, we can. But guns, come on now. You don't know how to use your hands? You know? Like, what? 
like what anyways i end up leaving because it was just we just studied going back and forth the girl don't want to fight and especially when her brother came out talking about some shoe and stuff up i have my baby in the car i'm only gonna take it to a certain extent i already feel like i shouldn't have took my baby to go fight the girl anyways but when they talk about guns okay too far mind you i had just got my hair done just got my hair done just for vlogmas just for this just for vlogmas and like why would i mess my money up for some irrelevant girls like my job it was two girls in the car it was two girls in the car and it's crazy because i knew one of the girls and she was just talking mess too everybody they would just kept talking mess about me like how how you like imagine a fan crash you and they talking mess about you like you're upset with me because you crashed me so you want to start talking mess about me? Like, she knew my whole life. She started to talk about everything. My baby daddy, me, my age, what I do for a living, what I be posting, all the other stuff. She literally talking about my whole life. And it would just make me so mad. But I just ended up letting her go and just going home. Because my auntie like, come on, Missy, let's just go. Let's just go. The baby in the car, the baby in the car. So all I can just think about my son. I would just think about my son in the beginning because it made me so mad because that my baby could have been in a predicament. To, my baby was in a predicament to be hurt. And she didn't even have no care or no sense to say, oh, I apologize. Okay, there's no dent in your car or nothing. I apologize. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. But she didn't say nothing. And I asked her, like, when she hit my car, she didn't even say, she, she didn't want to, she didn't have no acknowledgement or no nothing. But, and my baby's in the car. Like, I feel some type of way about that. Like, my baby, anything could happen to my baby. Like, for real. I don't even play, I don't even play like that by him at all. So, yeah. Long story short, I end up leaving. I did not fight the girl because her brother wanted to come out talking about guns and shooting people. And I, I'm a mom now. Certain stuff I can't be doing. Certain stuff like this I can't be doing, period. Because girls are grimy. They will probably try to do something to my baby. Like, he started shooting. What if it go to my baby? I would hate myself for the rest of my life. Or what if he would have shot me? My baby would have grew up without a freaking mom. Since they wanted to start talking about guns instead of fist. If it was just fist, it would have been a different story. But guns, okay, now you're just doing too much. This is a girl's fight, dude. Why you a big, black, bunky, big, bu Why are you in a girl's fight? Anyways, I ended up letting it go and we left. So y'all, that's the story time of everything that happened when I literally got into a car crash with my baby in the car and I was gonna fight the girl with my baby in the car. And it was just so freaking scary. I was just scared for my son the whole time. I just wanted to, I just, I just, I just, I, I was just scared for my son. That's all I kept thinking about was my son, my son, my son, my son, my son, my son, my son. I should have never did that in the first place. I just feel like if the girl wanted to fight when she first hit my car, okay, that would have been cool, you know? But she want to pull up to people's house, this, that, and the third, like, that's crazy. That's crazy. But y'all, that's the story time. It was so crazy. My baby slept through the whole time. He didn't even, he didn't even flinch, okay? Even when his car, even when my car got hit and my car went like this and I swerved, so the car won't go like this. But even though I got hit, my car still went like this. And when I start curved, it still went like this. He did not flinch an inch. And I'm just happy and thankful that my baby is okay. And I'm just saying, y'all, I, I don't even know if I was alone, I probably would have handled it a way different. I couldn't do much because my son was in the car. I already did too much while my son was in the car. So I was already mad. So anyways, thank y'all for watching this video. I just want to say y'all, if something like this happened to me, just give me some advice because I wouldn't know what to do. Mom told me I should have just came home. I, I, just coming home, okay, that sounds like a good thing. But if you're me and think how I think, well, maybe older virgin people probably think I would have came home, but just let me know what y'all think in the comments. Should I cook? Should I went home? Yeah. Should I went home and not even entertain that girl? Like for real, she really sounds like a fan, a fan that just wanted—I don't know what she wanted. Like. <laughs>
my life basically because she knew it all but anyways y'all thank y'all so much for watching my video it is vlogmas and i'm ready to post back to back to back to back i'm going to be posting every single day i know i missed the first but today is the second and i'm going to be posting another video right after this today so make sure y'all stay on the lookout to be ready to watch my next video and don't forget y'all if you guys are in the chicago area i am coming to chicago i am going to post a flyer up on the screen <laughs> so y'all can see it once again if y'all want to see me plus it's more people coming that's on the flyer if y'all want to meet them if y'all want to meet me come on down it's going to be a meet and greet so come on meet me y'all i get y'all tickets i'm so ready to meet my supporters and i know i have a bunch of supporters in chicago so if you're in chicago come on down okay thank y'all so much for watching this video um let me know what other videos y'all want me to do it is vlogmas time i already do some christmas videos with my son okay comment down below what videos you think i should do because i'm really interested it's vlogmas and i'm ready to turn up tee me up i'm ready to tee up <laughs> you already know what i'm gonna say and if you don't you better get hip to the gang even though we missed you we always kiss me gang gang deuces Mr. Gang, wow!